Hi friends. I'm going to make some pesto sauce for you. This is the simplest thing ever, ever. I've got basil from the school garden. I've got some nice fresh garlic olive oil. Now really a traditional pesto sauce also has pine nuts or walnuts um, and also Parmesan cheese. I'm not going to do that in this preparation because I usually add those ingredients just before I'm gonna to toss it with my pasta sauce or if I'm gonna put it in something different, maybe I don't really want the cheese in it. So the first thing is with the basil, I've already mostly trimmed it, but sometimes it has, as you can see maybe there, a little bit of a stem. And in that case, I just kind of snip off that stem. So I just have the leaves, as you can see here. So I have my bowl of leaves that are all ready to go here. And with the garlic, by the way. The garlic, as you can see, this is a head of garlic. You want individual cloves of garlic, that's the small parts. And it has that papery covering on it. And the way that you get that off is very, very simple. You just take with your hand and just give it a good smash and that papery part comes off very easily. Sometimes I go ahead and I cut off this very tip of it, the root tip, if it seems kind of hard. And then I'm just going to chop that a couple of times. I've got a few pieces, other pieces of garlic here all ready to roll. And I just maybe cut it in half. What we're gonna do is we're gonna whir up the garlic with the olive oil here first. So this is extra virgin olive oil. Happens to be what I like the best. I'm not going to talk about different kinds of olive oils right at this point in time, but this is such a fabulous, fabulous thing. And really here where we are in Northwest Ohio, this is the only time you get to have this. So as you can see, I'm putting in a fair amount there and there is my basil. I'm going to kind of pack it down a little bit and then I'm going to turn it on. This is my Cuisinart food processor. 